when you went to Japan, so this is a question I I don't think, I don't I haven't asked you this since you got back. Yeah. Uh, obviously we love Disney, everything Disney. We've been to Disney World. I think you've been to I've, you've also been to LA Disney. Yeah, and the one we went to together in Orlando. Yeah. How did you like Japan's one? It was different. Uh, how so? Uh, everything's in Japanese for people that have never been. Did you expect that? I did because, you know, a bit of research beforehand. But then when you get there, it's so different. <laughs> did it still give you that magic? It did, but it's like that magic that you have with a grandpa that speaks a different language. Oh, that's good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, like, you have that, you have that closeness, but then the communication, the barriers, there's a barrier. Yeah. You want to be able to, or, you know, they're trying to express something to you, but you can't reciprocate it the way you want to because they won't understand it in that way. Yeah. So, you know, we you hear the theme songs, it's a small world. Uh, but it's, in, Japan, but it's Japanese. in Japanese. That's what key things I remember. Or any theme song, but it's in Japanese. I wonder if it's, I wonder if that's like in every other theme park, like in every other Disney. Like if you go to um, uh, Disneyland in China, yeah. Would that be the same thing? Probably or, it will be. Or or Paris. Because if you think about Disney movies, they're probably all in their own language. So why would they have it in English in in Paris and in China? Yeah, yeah. Because, yeah. You, they wouldn't be able, It's the same thing. They wouldn't be able to understand it. Yeah. I liked it. When I, when I was there, I liked it. Um, it, it was good because... Like, the, for example, Tower of Terror is also in Disney World as well. Yeah. Right? And we actually done that same ride. And uh -huh. the story is kind of the same, but it was just different. So when you say, like, there's a barrier, it's like, you're kind of understanding it, yeah. but you're not like, I don't feel like my heart was invested. Yeah. This invested. is what I mean. There's like family, some family members, you're trying to express as much as you can in in a way. And you'll feel it, but it won't be the same than if you could under speak the language and you know it's different yeah i get that i get that speaking of disney world they've actually um yeah so the thing about sorry to cut you off but the thing about japan is the two different you know the disneyland japan or disneyland tokyo and then disney sea yeah so that's a difference as did, well. did you go both of them or yeah just, in one day oh, oh shit. yeah yeah so that. we went really early and um wasn't was there like I, I, it was I, packed, yeah. Yeah, I heard it like like in the morning. But it rained out. So oh. I think it cancelled a lot of people, but it was still very busy. Which one did you like better? I liked both. Well, I think one's for kids and one's for like more of a couple adults. Yeah, right? I think the Disney Sea is more for adults. But, you know, the nostalgia of Disneyland Tokyo is very similar to when we went to Disney World and yeah. when we went to... Um, when I went to California one as well. What do you, um, did you see anything that was like, oh, not different, but for example, did you, did you wait to the end? Oh yeah, we did, but we didn't watch the one in Disney, Disneyland. We stayed at Disney Sea. Yeah. Cause it'd be different. It'd be different. It was right? different. Yeah. So we did, but it was quite underwhelming. Yeah. In a way. <laughs> yeah, no, you're not. Yeah. yeah I, I felt that. I think, but then it was weird because. They were saying that if you go to the one in Disney Sea, you can't see the one in Disneyland. Yeah, but then the when we time. left Disney Sea, <laughs> as we're leaving and we're going on the train and that, a few minutes later, then the fireworks came out. I go, oh, we could have made it. Oh, that sucks. Oh, yeah. so it's not exactly the same time. No, no. It's like, okay. Yeah. I, when you say it's underwhelming, like uh, a bit, I get that. Because it's, um, it's a projection. Yeah, yeah. I, and I, then again, it's a language we can't understand. See, like... I think also it's a culture thing too, because when I was there, I was like, I was like, um, I wanted to get the best seat, right? So I, I went straight to the gate, uh, like the the fence, right? Yeah. So I stayed on that. I'm standing up, and then I'm like, I'm looking behind me, and everyone's still sitting down. Mm. And then like, one of the pe one of the Disney people actually had to come up to me, like, "Hey, so you have to sit down." Yeah. And I'm like, oh shit. And then I'm like right at the fence. So I couldn't see it as like clearly. And I'm like. Yeah, because, you know, people over there have 
Courtesy, courtesy. <laughs> yeah, you <laughs> and you, you don't. No, it's a it's definitely you look out for yourself. No, it's a westernized thing. You know why? Because oh yeah, blame of westernized. Bro, when, I bet I bet when we were in like Disney World, we're all like bumping into each other. But there, it's like no, nah, sit down, sit down. Yeah, because they look. Yeah, they consider it. Where were you sitting or standing? I was just standing at the back because I'm tall, and I said if I go up into the middle or the front, I'm gonna block a lot of people. That's very nice of you. Yeah. That's very courteous. Because I understood the assignment when we got to Tokyo that, oh, this is how they act. Let me not be a typical Aussie. You know what? You know what it shows? It shows that because you've been to Philippines a lot of times. It was like that respect is just kind of more. No, I'm just a, I'm just a good person. Oh, no, yeah. All right. All right. I'm oh. just not a dickhead. All right. <laughs> This guy back in the festival was like, no, get out the way, mosh pit. <laughs> like if you, if you think about it, yeah, but you know, think about, read the room. We're at, we're in a mosh pit at a festival. Yeah, let's go hard. Let, we're at Disney Sea with all these families and kids in Japan where everyone is like bowing and making sure, yes, he, you, this way and everything. And then you're oh, all, let, let me just stand that one right in front of everyone at the fence so that nobody, the people behind me, nah, let them figure it out. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know what? I was trying to look for, I was trying to look for my, um, you know, I, wanted that, I wanted that right girl to see me. Oh my gosh. She didn't see me though. Yeah. Because they made me sit yeah. down. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she saw you all right. <laughs> the security guy, <laughs> the, the, Disney, the Disney girl told you to sit down. It was a moment just then too. She just like, was like you oh, thought excuse. it was a moment. She's like, excuse me. I was like, oh, hey. <laughs> and she's like, sit down. <laughs> I'm like, my bad. <laughs> but, um, oh, so you went to, you went to both, you went to both of them. Was there, so you said it rained out. Yeah, it was raining. <laughs> The morning, it was the only day out of our five days in Tokyo that it rained okay. on the day. And we, were, <laughs> we woke up, we looked outside, and like, man, it's raining, raining. And we were like, fuck, we already got it all booked. Let's fucking go. <laughs> like, let's just go. Went early and we we're only two stops away from Tokyo Disney, our hotel. We made sure of that so we could go early. And we're just in the rain, in the cold. We actually, stay tuned, we're going to make a vlog about it. But yeah, we're just in the rain for an hour or two before it opens. That's great. Yeah. yeah. So if you see those lines on TikTok, we were doing that. Yeah, that that was the thing I was talking about. Like, cause that was because that's like a like a viral thing yeah. about how long the lines are there right before you go into Disney Sea or Land. Yeah. 